Hi, this is Rick from Rick's Daily Tips Tech Blog. As you probably know, Windows 11 has dozens of settings you can tweak to enable or disable certain features, make your system run faster, enhance system security, or just make the Windows user interface easier to use and more pleasing to the eye. Unfortunately, these settings are scattered all over the place within your Windows installation, and tracking them all down can take days, and that's assuming you even know where to look. Well today I'm going to tell you about a super handy tool called Ultimate Windows Tweaker that puts virtually every Windows setting you can change in one easy to use app. You can download Ultimate Tw Windows Tweaker for free from OlderGeeks.com. Just visit the home page and type Ultimate Windows Tweaker into the search box. Once you're on the download page, scroll to the bottom of the page and click the big green Download Now link. I'll also put the URL for the download page in the description below this video. That way you can, just, you can just go directly to the page. Just copy and paste that URL into your browser's address bar. After you download the app, unzip the compressed folder that you downloaded, and you should see a new folder that looks like the one on my screen, this one right here. Ultimate Windows Tweaker is a portable app, which means you won't have to install it on your computer. You can just run it directly right from the .exe file. Once you're on the download page, this is what you should see. Scroll all the way to the bottom. Click this big green Download Now button. I'm not going to click it because I already have it on my system. But once you click that, it'll download the zipped folder that you're going to unzip. And here's the folder that, that here's the unzipped folder that contains the files. Open it up. Click on Ultimate Windows Tweaker V5. Right click on Ultimate Windows Tweaker 5.0.exe and click Run as Administrator. Answer yes to the user account control dialog. And here we have the app open on the screen. The first thing you'll see is the system information. That's basically your Windows version and a little bit of information about the hardware in your system. Click on customization and you'll see that there are a bunch of things you can change here. Um, I'm not going to go through all of them because that would take forever but you can go through all of them and, and just try the ones you want to try. If something doesn't turn out the way you want it to turn out or you don't like the change you can always come back into Ultimate Windows Tweaker and reverse the change you made. Now up here you have several different tabs, like these are these are settings that affect the, ta the taskbar. You can change those. Here's some settings that t that uh, affect the file explorer. And one that I like is this PC. You can add all of these different things directly to the this PC dialog. I like having the control panel on there and uh, just power options and just things that I use on a regular basis. Once you're finished with customization. You can go down to user accounts and you can look through all of these and they're pretty much self-explanatory. Same way with performance, security and privacy. These are some, these are some good uh, settings here to change if you really want to lock down the privacy and security of your system. And you can go through the rest and like I said they're pretty uh, self-explanatory. Before you make any changes I would recommend that you click this button and create a restore point. That way if uh, you make a change that you really can't seem to reverse or that causes a, an issue with your system, you can go back and restore the system from that restore point. That's pretty much it. If you found this tip useful, please hit like and subscribe. That'll help me grow this channel so I can help even more folks with my tips. Thanks a bunch.